Hello, my fellow warriors, and welcome back to um, Modded Out Oblivion. I almost forgot the title of the series there for a second. Um, this is officially episode three. Now, if you remember in the last episode right here was an alien home. Well, I got rid of that because uh, it crashed as I was leaving, and I, it wasn't to my taste, so I deactivated that mod. But there is... A new home mod that I'm I've installed and wait a second, where I think I saw a thing pop up when I first started active quest no I don't want active quests uh, in progress quests um, okay don't know. Um, guess not. Anyways, um, oh, and you'll see right here, uh, I forgot to show this in the first episode, join the Archaeology Guild. That's a, um, a quest that I actually had downloaded and installed. But before I do, wait. Oh, that's interesting. Is it still showing the... Oh no, it's showing something else. What is it showing? What the heck? Okay, you notice up there at the on the compass it's showing alien rune icon. And yet there's no Oh wait, there's one off over there somewhere in there. Duh. Anyway, so I'm I'm heading up here because I want to collect my mount real quick. Which uh my friend has already seen a screenshot of this which I'm super super excited about this like I said I'm, I want to fast travel as little as possible because hello you on fire you on fire you're not a very good bandit I'm just saying Excuse me, didn't mean to walk over you. Okay, so anyways, um, what was I saying? Is there another one? Where? Okay. Oh. Uh, you just keep following me, I guess. If there's actually something out there, which I begin to think there's not. So, um, yeah, but I was telling my friend that, um, you're a wolf. You are. Oh, you're a tough wolf. Okay, my, my, aren't, what? It's acting like there's a, something hostile after me, but, hmm. Anyways. Um, yeah, I, I showed my friend a screenshot of this mount, and why is the battle music playing? But she said that, uh, you know, it was cool. It wasn't exactly what she was expecting, but she said it was cool. And, yeah, I actually agreed with her on it. I love having these lamps here. It's pretty cool. Lamps of uh, Cyrodiil. I think that's the retextured signs that I had installed. But I heard something. Anyways, you'll notice as we're, well, actually you're seeing it already, as we get closer to the mountains, you're going to see large, giant crystals. Oh, now the music changed back. Large, giant crystals sticking out of the ground and everything. Oh, hello. You stuck. And I suck, so... Am I just not hitting you, or are you just glitched horribly? I think you're just glitched horribly. Oh, okay. Sorry, little wolf. 
can't pick it up. Uh oh. It's glitched. It won't go off the screen. Uh oh. Are you a. Oh, yeah, you are. See, and now you're dead. That's what you get. But thank you for hitting me, because you made that glitched arrow disappear off of me. Very much appreciate that. Or arrow um, interaction thing. Man, there are a lot of freaking enemies up here. Anyways, so, <coughs> yeah, this mount, I actually think is pretty stinking cool. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, is the map off or something? Oh, did you see a shooting star? That was another mod, uh, ra randomly, uh, or randomly, random shooting stars. Which stone are you? Oh, no. Which doomstone are you? Hester, I don't even know what that is. Um. Oh, no. I totally forgot what the doomstones even do. Oh, yeah, and you'll notice the Aurora Borealis and the... Where is this taking me? Okay. Yeah, the map is just slightly off. With the player cursor, anyway. Um, but yeah, you'll notice the uh, animated Aurora Borealis and also the new, the new moon and everything. I, oh, so freaking cool. And then the crystals, like I started talking about earlier, but forgot all about, um, it's, uh, that they're just texture replacements for actual rocks. The guy who made it, he, um, oh, that's a cool effect right there. That's so cool. I could actually just sit here and stare at this. This is uh, amazing. Anyways, um, but yeah, he said all he did was replace the textures of uh, basic rocks with that of crystals. And, and so, yeah, it replaced some of the crystal or the rocks up here in the mountains with crystals. It's only in the mountains, too. And he's also on the added. Okay, you saw that, right? Something went up that wasn't a shooting star. I don't think, anyway. Maybe it just... Whoa, okay. Maybe the graphic, or the uh, texture just glitched through be the Aurora Borealis there. I don't know. Oh, yeah, it must have been what it was. Well, that, that stinks. Well, see, that's the thing with a, a bunch of mods is you're going to see stuff that you, you know, wouldn't see in the normal game. Where's Dragon Claw Rock at? Is it up here? I see you over there. I wonder if I can hit him from here. Well, he moved. That stinks. Oh, there's my mount. I see it. What the? Why am? Why do it look like I got hit? Gosh dang it! Stupid wolf. Well, this is increasing my destruction skills and everything. That's cool. Oh, I got him! I got him! Nice. I was aiming way too high. I'm not used to the arrow drop in this game anymore. Okay, so my mount's over here. Uh, Kieran, I think is its name. It's half dragon, half unicorn. It's so freaking weird. And cool at the same time. Oh, look, he's got the little Chinese uh, dragon whiskers. Oh, that's cool. And he's scaled and everything. With hair in very weird places. Anyways, so, Kieran, yeah. So now I have a mount, thank God. 
Wow, you're fast too, Kieran. And and uh, the mod author said that uh, he's set to essential, so he can't die. And they said he's got a beefy amount of um, of HP anyway. So this is cool. Okay, so back to the player home thing. Like I said, with the alien uh, ruined uh, player home gone now. Um, I've downloaded another one, which I'm gonna have to go back to the Imperial City for. Okay, game's having trouble keeping up with me here. Am I heading the right way? Yeah. Okay, forgot where it said the portal was to this place. Oh well. We'll just keep following the path. Yeah, this this horse is freaking awesome, by the way. Or say it's a dragon slash unicorn. So I guess a U unigon or a dragicorn, whatever you want to call it. it it's pretty awesome because he's super fast. Shadow Mirror's in this game, right? Or is that just in Skyrim? The the horse that you get from uh, doing the Dark Brotherhood quests. I'm not sure, in all honesty. Man, frame rate's dropping because I'm going so fast. That's the funny thing about this, though, is that... Um, okay, I'm back down near the Imperial City. Okay, let's see if I can see what I'm looking for. I don't know if it's even visible from down below. Guess not. Okay, so I forgot where they said the portal was. Sorry, Mr. Deer. Oh, wait, they said it was at the entrance to the Imperial City. Alright, come on, Kieran. Let's go this way. Uh, you know what? Nah, nobody wants to watch me do this, so I'm going to go ahead and fast travel over to here. This is going to take me forever, and I don't want these videos to be, you know, just me. I mean, it's going to be me wandering, but, you know, for this purpose, yeah, there's just no point. Okay, so. Where's the portal? Why is there a random painted horse hanging out around here? Um, maybe it's... He said it was near the... Huh. He said it was just outside the entrance of the Imperial City. I don't care about that. I... Yeah, I don't see a portal. I don't see a flying city either, or a flying city, a flying home, but like I said, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's... Oh wait, was that there before? It might have been. I don't know. We'll go over there and see. Uh, so the thing I hate about some mods is that the authors don't actually tell you exactly where everything is at. And, you know, they just give you a vague idea now. I think this is just... I think. Stay there, Kieran. Don't run away on me. Yeah. Huh. Okay, Kieran, I have no idea where... I'm supposed to be going for this. Maybe it's inside. I didn't mean to do that. Maybe it's inside the city. I don't know. Okay, Kieran, how good are you at climbing? You are horrible at climbing. Okay, never mind then. Cool. Okay, there we go. Wait, what's that over there? There's something else over there, too. Oh, that's just... 
Hmm. I honestly don't know. I, I guess I'll step inside and see what's there. So there's not more than one entrance to the city, is there? I think this is it. Might have to pause the video and go go search for it. Hey, have you guys seen a magic portal anywhere? It, it leads to my house. Yeah, there's nothing here. Um, okay, well, um, I'm going to figure this out. I will be right back. Okay, well, I'm back. Um, yeah, so found out, I mean, there is supposed to be a portal somewhere, but I also found out that there is actually a spell. So... Hi. I'm going to wait till it's daytime, though. It's almost there. We shall rest for five whole hours. I'm going to sleep standing up in the middle of the Imperial City. That's a pretty shot. Ow, I just tip my elbow. My oh, look! Lots of rain. That's cool. That's totally what I wanted. Well, anyways, hopefully it's not raining on the island. Uh, yeah. Go to the Flying Island? Why, yes, I would love to. Hopefully the game didn't crash. We shall see. No, it did not. And it's still raining. Cool. Uh, let's wait 24 hours. Oh, I hate this. I know I could use console commands to change to clear weather, but I really don't want to deal with it right now. Come on, game. Let, let it be clear. And you notice all the rain that was coming down. You know how heavy it's coming down everything. That's actually a mod, too. It's called Downpour. Not entirely sure I like it because it kind of makes everything like foggy and weird looking. Okay, please tell me there's no rain. Ah, there we go. Oh, dude. Look at that. That's amazing. Oh, this is cool. Wow, that's almost got a Skyrim type texture to it. That's cool. Oh, wow. Bottom of a well. Okay, now I gotta look at this. So, note to self do not go down the well. The game crashed again. So, that's a thing that happened. Whoa, what is this? Oh, that must be the bath that they were talking about. That's cool. I like it. Cool, cool. Don't like the random pop-in, but that's cool. Nice. Okay, we've got to go up top before we look out. Look out over our kingdom. Ooh, what's this? Where's this go? Oh, Imperial City. Okay. That's freaking cool, though. Look at that. That's amazing. Literally have the greatest view on the face of Tamriel. Or even Nern. That's so cool. Okay, this is much better than the Alien House. Again, no offense to the mod creator there. That's Harvest ginseng plant, okay. So I, I have some alchemy ingredients in this place too. Cool, cool. Alright, so now the question is, you know, I tried to go down to the well and it crashed. So will I even be able to enter the house, period? That's the big question. Here's the moment of truth. If I come back here in a second, I'm still outside, you'll know what happened. Oh, 
Okay, sweet. It worked. Sorry I was so quiet there. I, I didn't want to talk, you know, in case, you know, I said something so, somewhat intelligent and funny. And, um, and you know, the game crashed and, you know, it would have got cut off. So, that's, I love all the new paintings and everything that that one mod added. This is cool. I see. I like this better. It's it's a little more cozy looking. Ooh, neat. Glass case. Alien statue display. Um. Those aren't alien statues, but it's cool to know that that's for that because I am totally gonna make use of that. Oh, neat. This is cool! Sliding doors! Isn't this the coolest thing ever? Are there sliding doors normally in this game? This is amazing! Okay, anyways. Oh wait, what was in there? Oh, it's just storage area. That's cool! I like this. Anything good in there? No? Really? You didn't supply any jewels to me? That's cool! I can stick my hand in there if I want to. I won't, but that's cool. Oh, hey, hello. Notice how shiny the gold pieces are. I, I know it's hard to tell. Yeah, see? That's also a mod. Yeah, li literally the game got a complete overhaul. Okay, I don't want to go out there. There's a lot of popping in this mod, though. That's kind of depressing. Oh, sweet. I've got my own uh, altar of enchanting. Oh, wait. Where's the... I didn't get anything from that. Really? Do I have to read all the way through to... Huh. I thought those were two books that you always got. Oh, anyways. Display cases, cool, cool. It's only two of them. That's kind of sad, but well, isn't this just fancy? Oh, gold. Love me some gold. What waterfront? I have a waterfront. I have waterfront property here. Oh, it's too bad they didn't have like um, actual. Uh, physics on the curtains. Cool. I have a bed. That's awesome. Oh, I like the model ship. That's cool. Wait. Is it? Oh, that's cool. The little sails are, are moving on it. Can't tell if it's actually kind of swaying or it might be a effect of that mod that I have. Wait, what did I just pick up? Eh, I don't know. Whatever. Cabinet door. Cool, cool. Nice. Liking it so far. Eh, this might be a bad thing. Nope. It's cool. Now see, this is a, a chair I could see sitting in. Because, I mean, look. Look at the view. Dude, I could seriously in real life see myself sitting out here except for the weird floating trees because the uh, model isn't loading in. But anyways, I could, I could literally see myself in real life sitting out on a balcony like this and just, you know, reading, eating breakfast, whatever. I don't understand, though, why the, um, the game's not popping in the model though that's weird but anyways I think that's it ow my face yeah it's taking a long time to it won't load in the objects until I get like right next to them it only does that here though didn't do that when I'm down below and I guess I'll see where this takes me oh hey through the basement Reinforced door to the bathroom? Uh oh, this might be bad. I might... Oh. 
Guess not. I was gonna say I might crash here. Nice wood flooring. Ah, what the? Uh, oh. Really? Uh oh. Oh, okay. So. Wait. That's weird. Ah. It's actually a cool bathroom. I mean, except for the fact that, you know, um, I don't have a, uh, a toilet. That's a little weird, but okay. All right, now I gotta put my clothes back on. I'll go shadow bow this time around. Okay. Well, that's cool. It's interesting. It's different. So I'm assuming this goes out to, oh, guest room. Oh, my crash. Nope. Whoa. Okay, this is cool. Look at all these display cases. This is the guest room. It should be the master bedroom. Holy cow, dude. Huh. Why are the guest rooms so much more fancy than in my bedroom. It hurts my feelings. I think I might just sleep down here. That's pretty cool. I like it. Still don't like the fact that things just pop in, but you know. That's awesome. I like it. Oh wait, there was a barn out front too. I, I need to go check that out. Yeah, see, I don't like the fact that that... Can I paint? Oh, I can't paint. But, that's okay. I'll deal with the pop-in. I'm fine with it. That's a cool image. Whoa! Storage for days! Wait, I thought that said barn. This isn't a barn. Wait, were there repair hammers anywhere laying around here? Scythe, pickaxe. Nope, guess not. Shears. A bucket of stuff. Slop, I guess. Cool. Alright. I wonder if that wasn't even supposed to be accessible in the first place. That's, yeah. Anyway, so where does this go? Mage's Guild portal. Oh, really? Can I fall off of here? I don't really think I want to try. That's cool, though. I actually want to see where the one up top takes me to. Uh, hello. Okay. There we go. Okay. Wait, what? Wait. Where did I find... Wait, seriously, where did I find that one portal at? Uh, no, at the cabinet door, stupid. Um. Oh, wait, I, I remember. Duh. It's all the way down here. I do like this though. This this actually is a pretty cool house mod. Okay, here we go. Let's see if it crashes. I must be the um, lusty Argonian maid or something. Oh, there's the wait. Oh, I bet you it was there the whole time. So that would be why I didn't see it. Because, oh, I'm, actually I'm getting some pop in there too. 
Maybe it's just the way it's going to be. Anyways. Ah, I'm stuck. Wait, where'd my... Where's Kieran? Oh, there you are. Don't run off on me like that, Kieran. I'm lost without you. I like playing with your little whiskers. Oh, you're such a pretty horse. Or... Unigon, or whatever you are. Um, anyways. So, I think I'm actually going to leave... Leave this episode here, in all honesty. Um, it's pretty cool. I, I'm actually really liking... Uh, what I've got going on so far. I just kind of wish that, uh... I haven't been to those ruins, right? It's been... Uh, man, I don't know where what's where anymore. Or what's what. No, I haven't been to those yet. Well, anyways, we'll check those out in the next episode. So, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm enjoying this so far. I mean, this is really cool. I'm anxious, though, to get into the exploring and... and fighting and questing and stuff like that so uh we'll start that in the next episode uh, like like i said these first few episodes were mostly trying to gather the equipment needed to survive and and uh, yeah go and get the player home and everything and now i'm ready to go ahead and wait what is that see that up there is that a bird It's moving, whatever it is. Anyways. Um, so yeah. Fix follower double face bug? What is that supposed to mean? That's weird. Anyways, whatever. Um, so yeah. Uh, thanks for dealing with uh, me, you know, exploring, you know, or gathering equipment in the mount and exploring player homes in the first few episodes. But uh, starting the next episode, there's going to be uh, normal questing and exploration and everything. So if you've played Oblivion and you don't want to see me just randomly ride through the countryside and explore ruins and towns and stuff like that, then probably shouldn't watch the rest of this series because that's what it's going to be and uh like i said i'm going to go all the way through oblivion i'm gonna uh you know explore all of cyrodiil do as many of the quests as as i can do i probably won't do every little bitty thing because that would take so long but you know anything i run across randomly okay so the game crashed as i was closing out my um my video and uh, so I respawned at my previous save and it was and I, I went ahead and thought well maybe it's just a random crash that man it won't let me move on hmm guess you can't actually get in there I wonder if I toggle clipping if I can get over there Anyways, um, but yeah, I, I guess the game's just going to randomly crash here and there, which stinks. I'm not sure what's causing it, but, um, yeah, so we're toggling off clipping, so I want to get over here and see what this is. Oh, open door to waterfront, okay. Uh-oh! Oh! oh. Oh, so I bet you it's to each mage's guild, isn't it? Yep. Shaden Hall, Bruma, Leowin, Bravo, Skingrad, Coral, Kavach, and Anvil. That's pretty freaking cool. So anyways, yeah, you did. every video I do apparently is going to be chopped up into multiple pieces because it looks like the game is for some odd reason going to randomly crash on me. So, um, well, I mean, I know why. It's because of mods. I'm going to uh, do some checking, see if I can figure out what's causing the problem. But if not, whatever. I'll just uh, just deal with it. So, thank you for joining me in this episode. Uh, like I said uh, before, I got 
cut off. Uh, I'm going to play as much as uh, any random quests I run across. I'm going to do those. And I'm obviously going to do main quest and, you know, try to do as many guild quests as I can. And, yeah, then after that, I'm going to move on to, uh, to Sky, or to Sky, <laughs> to uh, Morrowind, do it, and uh, you know, I, actually probably after I finish the base game of Oblivion, I'll probably do a mixture of Morrowind and then do the Hammerfell uh, mod along with Elsewhere and everything. I'll probably just kind of mix in the rest of it. I may mix in the rest of it now anyway. But um, yeah, so uh, thank you for joining me in this episode of Modded Out Oblivion, an incredibly unstable Modded Out Oblivion. Uh, I am the Holy Warrior. God bless you all.